hello and welcome to my youtube channel my name is tony denmark and a little bit about me i am going into my junior year as a biology major pre-medicine track and i'm also on the track and field team and involved in a couple of things on campus right now it is june 18th and so far i've just been working as a nurse's aide um that counts as clinical experience so that's kind of what i've been doing all summer and that's what i did all last summer as well so i'm getting quite a bit of clinical experience and the next thing that i'm planning on doing this summer is getting an internship at a hospital just shadowing doctors really i'm just waiting to apply because i have to get a background check for it and i did it's just a whole mess but anyway i didn't know i had to be home to sign for it and um i was home but i couldn't get to the door fast enough in time so they left a sticker saying we'll catch you next time and i thought they were just going to send it in the mail so now i told them to hold it at the post office and i'll come get it so as soon as i get that background check i can upload it to my application and we can go ahead and get started with that in july the requirements for that application if you guys were wondering was i had to have a tb test covid vaccination a background check and i guess approval from my school once i get that turned in i'll be able to start that internship pretty soon here and that'll get me my shadowing hours um on top of that i will probably get some more shadowing hours throughout the school year so i can have plenty and then I have plenty of clinical and I'll work on getting some volunteer hours as well. Okay, so the classes that I'll be taking this fall is microbiology and lab. And then I will also be taking sociology. And that's for fall one because we split our we split our semesters into two, so all together it's four. So we get a fall one and a fall two. Fall one, I'm taking microbiology, lab, and sociology. Now, for fall two, it's the big old cam. <laughs> um, organic chemistry with lab. And fortunately, that's the only classes that I'll be taking because of this internship. It's, if I get 90 hours in, it counts as two credits. And that will satisfy my credit need for that semester. So, those are classes that I'll be taking. I'll be making videos soon about the i guess material that i'll be getting for it and if i do well i'll make a little study video on how i studied on it the third big thing that i'm doing or that i'll be starting soon is mcat planning so i plan on taking my mcat beginning of january sometime i i'm going to wait to schedule it because i think I can't schedule it no more than six months in advance. So I'm gonna have to wait till next month to register for that. I will be making a study plan pretty soon here. And I think I'm gonna give myself four months to study. So I'll start in September only because um, I did struggle a little bit in chemistry. And so I wanna make sure I have enough time to relearn anything that I need to relearn or just get a solid foundation on it, you know what I mean? I'm giving myself four months and we'll be taking it in January. If it's not the score I want, I'll give myself another three months and try to take it again in April. So then I'll have my scores by back by May and I can go ahead and apply. I was thinking about taking a gap year just because of financial business, you know what I mean? Because um i really want to buy the mcat buy an mcat prep course but as you guys know it's like two thousand dollars and lord knows i don't got two thousand dollars on hand like that because i'm buying myself a car right now and so we're going to have to figure something out for that um if i were to take a gap year i could totally afford it and probably get a better grade but we're still going to try our best. I'm going to at least try. If my MCAT score isn't where I need it to be, um, I will probably take a gap year. The plan is we're going straight into it.
really all I got for a little update on a pre-med going into her junior year. If you guys have any questions, please leave a comment down below. Make sure to subscribe and like this video. Very appreciated. My next video that's coming out will probably be pre-med jobs. And I'll talk a little bit about that. So make sure to subscribe to stay tuned to that. And I will see you guys in my next video. Okay, bye.